Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Sam's Choice items for you. Sam's Choice is a Walmart brand. Uh, we have the Thins, Thins with Crispy Rice Puffs. Uh, we have Dark Chocolate. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I said the Thins. Uh, we have <laughs> Dark Chocolate and Sea Salt Caramel Milk Chocolate. And I have the Dark Chocolate Almond Truffles and the Dark Chocolate Sea Salt Caramels. Uh, the thins were two ninety eight. The the truffles were three ninety eight, and the sea salt was four ninety eight. So it's all a big bag, all different prices. Okay, I have to try to get through this review without being totally juvenile. Um, when we hear that somebody <laughs> has the the fins, this isn't what I'm thinking. Okay, this is a 4.4 ounce container. I like how they say the container actually says up all up. over and it has up on the top of it. They're letting you know so that you won't get Upside ticked down. off yeah. if it goes all over the kitchen floor. But it'd be your fault for not looking. Uh, four servings in the container, nine pieces. They must be, well, they're thin. Uh, 160 calories. They must be really thin though. A product of Belgium. So even though we bought them at uh, Walmart, they're a product of Belgium. They look like little Pringles. How they do? Yeah. Now they do have crispy rice puffs. They say dark. They're dark. Mm-hmm. I mean, dry your mouth out. Bitter. Dark. They are dark, but you could take those and you could uh, uh, crush them up and put them in ice cream. You could. I and like I the think, texture. I think that would be, a, that's why I would do that because I think that would be a terrific texture because it is so crispy. That would be a nice crispy texture to add to a creamy ice cream, you just a vanilla ice cream. Bad thing is it would, it would, it's good, definitely going to make it a little more bitter. Yeah, I did. Now they might have milk chocolate. I did not see milk chocolate when we bought these. I only saw these two flavors, or I would have bought one of each. Well, this is milk chocolate. Uh, this is, but this is sea salt caramel. Right. So they didn't have just a plain milk right. chocolate. And boy, you can smell that caramel. Uh, this is nine pieces of 170 calories. Very similar texture to the dark one, except it's not snappy. That. That's good enough. Yeah, you can get a little salt with it. Mm -hmm. I would like to put like three of those together and eat them, and eat them all at once. Yeah. That is fantastic. Those are really, really good. That is like five out of five. That, that, um, they got a good amount of salt in there, which is nice. They're very, very sweet mm -hmm. with the salt and the caramel and the milk chocolate. And then you get the, the crunch, that crispy crunch, you're not going to be able to eat just one of those no. and walk away. You're going to want more. And the caramel kind of <clears throat> reminds you of toffee a little bit. Mm -hmm. It's, it's, fa that's fantastic. Yeah, it's very Love sweet, that. very salty, uh, but these, not overly salty. These are truffles. Well, I assume they're individually right. They oh. are. They're like this. They look like a lint. So this is a uh, premium European chocolate. This is dark chocolate. Oh, everything else is dark chocolate. Oh, is it? Yeah. I'm still getting salt from that last one and I love it. I love it when I have salt left in my teeth and so good. Um, if, if they had had the milk versions when we bought these, I'm telling you I would have got them. So this is... A collapse. It's gone. It's just gone. Um, this is uh, almond truffles, mm -hmm. though. Uh, so four servings in the container, three truffles are 230 calories. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. There's 12. Did you say that? There's 12. Mm -hmm. That's not bad. You do get like an almond butter kind of flavor, a little bit of almondy. How many kind of flavor? Yeah, but it's not like what they make it look like. No, there is a somewhat creamy center, but it's more firm than that. Well, but I mean, they made it... By saying almond truffle, I guess I'm just thinking of it wrong. By saying almond truffle, 
they put a picture of a whole almond on here. Yeah, there's some almonds in there. This one doesn't have any, but the one we, the one I had almond in it, like a hunk of almond. Mine did not. Oh, really? No, mine did not. I did not. I, I had a little piece. A little, yeah. Little pieces all through there. Yeah, but they make it. That's deceptive because they make you think that you're gonna get a whole almond in every piece. No. That's not the way it is at all. Yeah, but if they had done that like in Germany, they would have actually done that. They would have stuck put the, an almond in there. Yeah, they would have put the whole almond in here. That's this disgusting. one's little pieces like chips almost. Well, I hardly got any in mine whatsoever. Yeah, I got a bunch of mine. That dark chocolate is very, very different from the dark chocolate that yeah, we Yeah, it's not quite um, as the dark, bittery, kind of dry mm -hmm. mouth that kind of flavor. No. It's dark, but it's not that dark. Right. It's dark, but yes, but not that dark. It, you can even uh, see the color difference. It's not quite as dark as the, yes. the dark chips or whatever. Yeah, it doesn't have the uh, the rich, dark uh, flavor that the first one had. I don't mind it. I don't think it's bad I don't at all. Either. But I probably wouldn't buy them again. I wouldn't either. I'd buy them more if I'm going to buy them. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I wouldn't buy those again. Uh, these are dark chocolate sea salt caramels. I hope they're individually wrapped. They're not. No, I didn't think they would be. They're big though. They're really big. Yeah, these are big squares. And there's a lot of them. 17. There's 17 of those squares. It says Sam's Choice caramels are made in small batches. Each batch is cooked slowly to achieve a rich caramel flavor and a smooth texture. You'll love the taste of butter, premium chocolate, and a hint of sea salt. It's 100 calories for one of those. It must be bitter. Don't like that. Don't bite that in half. I mean, bite it in half. Don't eat the oh. whole thing. Mm. Oh. It's tough. It's thick. Um, no, it's actually really good. I don't have a problem with the dark, the dark chocolate. The dark chocolate. I mean, it is a little, a little bit bitter, but the caramel is so sweet. Mm-hmm. That it kind of offsets it. Mm -hmm. My problem is it's really, really tough. Not well, it's somewhat sticky, but it's really just a tough caramel to chew, almost like a taffy. <laughs> it's not, uh, like a laffy. It's a very, very stiff mm -hmm. caramel. Yeah. It's it's hard. It um, that is a hard caramel, and and um, I mean you can bite through it, but it's, but it's, it's hard still to bite through. Tough. It's hard to bite through. Um, I really love the flavor. The flavor's very, very good. The you flavor's get salt delicious. Mm -hmm. Yes, you get the salt, you get the caramel. I think it's delicious, but I couldn't buy them again because it's too hard. Yeah. It's just, it. it's not pleasurable to eat because it is so, that first bite, it's like, are you gonna hurt your teeth by mm -hmm. you know by having to pull on this thing? Well, you know how you know the reason. I think they're called reasons. Yeah, reasons. You know those are kind of like a caramel. They're really really hard. These aren't quite that hard. No, they're not but, as hard as a reason. But they're up there. But reasons are more manageable pieces. Yeah, they're small, and you can just put them in your mouth and yeah. let them warm up, and that's all. That's the issue with this. Not only is it hard, but it's also huge. Yeah. So, so you'd almost have to get an knife and like cut it into yes. fourths. <laughs> yeah, really, the it could be it could be half the size that they are. Yeah, that's um, true. And that would be very helpful if it was if it was half the size. Yeah. That would that would do. That would do a lot of good. Yeah. If you don't mind the size, though, the flavor is really good. I love the flavor. But the flavor is excellent. Uh, yes, the flavor's terrific, mm -hmm. and and like Kevin said, it, that that caramel really sweetens it up, mm -hmm. so that you hardly even notice that there's no. any dark chocolate. No, I got a little touch of bitterness towards the end, but then that was it. I mean, it's literally that was it. But those are the best things here. This is the best thing. This is the only, only milk chocolate here, but it's not even about the milk chocolate. Mm -hmm. I mean, the milk chocolate's good. No, because my number two would be those caramels. Yes, but it's about that sea salt caramel, and it delivers on the caramel. Mm -hmm. It delivers on the sea salt. Got a good texture. These are good, and yeah. these were only two ninety eight, three yeah, dollars. They're really good. Yeah, if you I have think a, if you like dark chocolate too, though, these are really good if you like dark chocolate. I think so too. You really need to like dark chocolate yeah. though. Now, I found all four of these in the candy aisle. So, down the aisle with the Reese's and the Three Musketeers, the bag candy. candy. That's where they were, and they were, when we bought them, they were on the very, very bottom shelf. Who knows where they'll be in your Walmart, but just go down the candy aisle and, uh, and look for them. But you need to get these. Yep. They're awesome. So, I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.